All right, in this hand, I've got a brand new, unworn, untouched, label still on them pair of Rafa leg warmers. In this hand, I've got the exact same leg warmers, but with 6,000 kilometers on them, ridden from December 2015 to February 2016 across winter. Rafa, on their website, claim these are designed for, and I quote, hard winter training rides. First, we'll look at the brand new ones, see how they fit, see how they're made, look at the quality. Then we'll look at what happens to them after you put 6,000 kilometers of hard winter riding through them. And again, you can guess what's gonna happen, right? All right, so this is one of the leg warmers on. They fit really nice. Uh, they hug your leg everywhere. The way they've laid the pattern's pretty good and shows they've really thought about it. Each panel kind of contours to the shape of your leg, which is pretty good. Just like the shorts when you first get them, there's no tight spots when you're first wearing them. And everything seems to be of an equal pressure around your leg. On the back there, you've got a Rafa logo, which is stuck on. Uh, there's a little reflective piece on the side, which is nice. Um, yeah, they, they feel really good when you first get them on. But the first time you go riding in them, after about 30 minutes, behind the knee is absolute agony. Absolute agony. To the point where, when I was riding, I had to go into a convenience store, get some plasters, take them off on the road, put plasters behind my knee, and carry on riding. When I checked out the back of my leg, it had a really bad rub on it that was bleeding by the end of the ride. I mean, that's, that's not good. From there, for the first probably three weeks of using these, so that's every day, three weeks, I had to get some of this stuff, which is like sports adhesive tape, cut it into sections, put that behind my knee before I went riding on them every time, and then put them on. Because if I didn't do that, I'd get like, the back of my knees would be bleeding. <laughs> which is, man, that's not good, is it? Now, obviously I checked with other people I knew who had these as well, and they also reported they had this issue. Um, I've even seen one guy, right, outside a convenience store, t pull his off and chuck him in the bin. He was that, he was in that much pain, <laughs> right? That isn't good. So that's the first thing that they've really fucked up with these. The second thing is like the shorts, which I reviewed, is the longevity of the product. So I'm gonna show you the 6,000 kilometers old version and then you can see exactly what goes wrong with them after 6,000 kilometers. Now, I'm sure you can already guess, um, it's the stitching and the materials that go wrong, all right? But we'll have a look in detail. All right, let's start looking in detail then. This is the right-hand side one. Um, here is the outer edge, so my calf muscle will go here. You can see, I mean, all that lycra has just scratched off. Right, and again, it's that sort of sticky feeling that was on the shorts. Completely perished here. This thread, where the zip goes, has come out. This logo, which they're stuck on the back, is peeling off. Right, look at that, all coming off. This is the elastic section that, that stretches to hold your the top of your leg. All of this thread is completely ripped and it's coming out at various points around the elastic section. There you go, look, it's just completely ripped open. On the outside as well, you can see the threads just come apart. So when you wear these now, they don't feel as, as snug as they do. And every time you, you shift around, you can feel them sort of clicking and popping and ripping where the thread's coming apart. So that's the right one. Let's look at the left one. Right, this is the left one. You can see the lycra's coming off even more on this one. It's coming off in big patches in the same area here. You can see the stitching is just completely ripped apart, right? Look at that, all the way down. Again, the logo has just totally shredded off. And the lycra is all perishing around here. The thread is coming out of this elastic section as well. The edge of this material is fraying. So, okay, right, so I'm looking at the website now. Okay, I'm looking at the rafa.cc website now and I, I'm gonna read the description of these leg warmers. Made from fleece-backed Robe fabric, leg warmers offer more extensive coverage than Rafa's popular knee warmers and are designed for hard winter training rides. And are designed for hard winter training rides. No, they're fucking not. No, they're fucking not. Another thing, these are the brand new ones that I haven't even touched. Brand new, I haven't worn them. 
right? Look at that. The thread is coming out already on these ones that I haven't even put on my fucking legs yet. What is this shit?